Hi, Mr. Bunnell, Schoology Technology Coordinator. We're going to talk about doing a Schoology assignment where a Google Doc has been attached to the assignment. So I've already logged in, as you can see. Um, we're going to click on the folder where the assignment is. Uh, Schoology assignment with Google Doc attached. Very clear. So when you log in here, you notice that it's a different window than when you log in to a, a to log in to do a, a, an assignment where the Schoology editor is used. So this one's a little bit different. You can see the assignment but once before. Read all the instructions for the assignment. Then I'm going to go click on my document. That's going to start the editor. And what it's going to do is one one uh, one point to remember is you must be signed in to your another tab if you're using a if you're not using a um, if you're not using a uh, Chromebook. You must sign in to another tab to be sure you're signed into your school to your um, school Gmail account. Or, or Google Docs account or Google Drive or something. So sign into Google uh, Apps. You, I usually sign in with Google Drive, and then that gets me signed in. So if you're using a Mac or, or a Windows machine, you have to be have two tabs open, one for Schoology, one for your Google Apps. Now that's done. When you open this up, it's going to start a Google Doc. It's going to create a, your, a Google Doc for you to work on. And um, so you can edit in this window, but the one of the few things that won't work is if you have add-ons, like I've got screenplay formatter as an add-on. And if I if your instructor had said, Oh, you've got to use screenplay formatter, click on edit, which will take you out to the Google Doc Google Docs app outside of Schoology. And this way some of the add-ons don't work within Schoology, then if you just click on the, the uh, edit, it'll take you out here. Now, note over here the, the assignment name. David Bennell, Schoology assignment with Google Doc attached, and there's a number. So this, this doc is attached to that Schoology assignment. So no matter what I edit on right here, whatever I type on, it will be included in that assignment. I also don't want to move this. This, this document was created in my Google Drive somewhere. I don't want to move it or mess with it other than I can just open it there. You can open it directly in Google Drive uh, from your Google Drive and, and start working on it. But uh, th so that's basically it. You're going to open up the Schoology assignment. It's going to open a Google Docs a window in your Schoology, you know, account. Then you click on My Document, which will create the document. And to edit this outside of Schoology, click on Edit. Last little bit. I'm going to click on Submit. When I'm, I'm done typing and everything, I'm going to click on Submit. Now, unlike the Schoology editor, you don't have to copy the text because Google, um, the Google assignments, they update all the time. So as it goes, it's saving, it's saving, and saving. So I can just close out of this. I can click back on Assignment. I can look at the assignment again. I can go back to my document, and it's, it's going to open all up again. But it's not creating a new document every time. It's going to save whatever I write here. So. Here's my new addition to the, this assignment. And if I go out to, oh, that's not it. That's not it. There it is. And in the now, notice in the editor, it's already been updated. So a little more advanced. There's more uh, editing tools in the Schoology editor. Schoology editor works for quick assignments. This might be a longer paper or something like that. Um, so that's it. How to, this is how to do an assignment that has a Google Doc attached.